Hi di ho and welcome to another season of Spellade TV, this time with Biomutant. And well, if you had enough from the Fallout hype, <laughs> or you want to see some cute animals during a post-apocalyptic uh, during a post-apocalyptic event, then enjoy this. Willkommen bei Biomutant. What a beautiful cinematic. This game has really something to offer. <laughs> But first, like usual for some games, we get into the character editor. You can yeah, choose here your race, your class and some other yeah, cosmetics. <laughs> And you will see directly your origin is affecting your skills. And now, last but not least, <laughs> the class that we choose. For example, Sniper, Commando, yeah, or Security Man. <laughs> In total, five classes. Commando chosen. Sounds good. Here's somebody with a troubled past, drawn into the spotlight of a story that's already begun. <laughs> you will notice at the beginning that I first have to figure out how to defend myself.
a run for it. This is not the time nor place to end this story. In my opinion, really uh, enjoyable adventure game. Here you see another fighting scene. And yeah, this is all gameplay. So I think it's enjoyable. Dead already. It looks weak. The claw bar should come in handy. At that point, for example, you have here some sort of clicking event. Whoa! It's time to find a way out of this place. No, really, I mean it. And of course some mini games <laughs> and after this we will unlock a cinematic so stay tuned enjoy the ending and of course I mean the ending of our show not of this game <laughs> Just a few moves left. Make them count. There are few records of the chain of events that led to the big apocalypse eons ago, but it's clear the world wasn't prepared for how recklessly the Toxinor Corporation would make its mark on the world. Their rare earth mining and nuclear industries generated tons of waste and, without consideration for the future, they dumped it all in landfills until they ran out of space. That's when they made the big mistake. They began dumping the toxic waste in the surf just off the coast instead, assuming that it would sink and decay with time. And they were right, but no one was prepared for what was about to unfold. Once in the surf, the radiation interfered with the genetics of the wildlife and created bizarre mutations in their offspring. It had an inconceivable impact on biodiversity and the entire ecosystem. The world as they knew it crumbled as nature retaliated. It would never be the same again, and what remained of it became ours. Know that the tree of life is dying. Its days are numbered. Without help, it can't endure the environmental change and assault from the world eaters.
I hope you enjoyed that little journey into something different. <laughs> But I think in my opinion it's a good game. I would like to hear your opinion, share your thoughts. Yeah, leave me some thumbs up, some comments. By the way, what you see now is the map, at least from the beginning. I don't know if there is a second map. Yeah. Leave me your thoughts about that game. I personally like it. We'll have to go on more through it. But in the meantime, yeah, we have a lot to do on the uh, on this channel. <laughs> so stay tuned and until the next time. Have a good week you all. That must be the world eater that chewed off out of date's leg. You'll need a hat trick to bring that down. <laughs> and really, feel free to comment a little bit. No matter what. Alright, have a good week you all.